Welcome to Venice Family Clinic. This video will provide an introduction to dental charting in NextGen. To log on, first select the NextGen icon on your desktop, and then click EDR. Once the login box opens, enter the username and password provided prior to orientation. Once you log in, select the appointments icon in the left upper hand corner. Enter your location and select dental students from the provider drop down list. Double click on the patient you want to chart on and their dental record will open. The front screen shows patient summary information such as current medications, allergies, contact information, and special notes. Once you close the summary screen, you will see the chart. We will now go through each portion of the chart. The first section, the dental chart, displays a schematic view of existing and planned dental work to be done on the patient. At the bottom of the screen, there is a history tab, which details work previously done on the patient, and a plan tab, which details future procedures. Here you also have the option of clicking both, and it will display the historical notes on top and the plan notes on the bottom. Next, you have the dentistry palette section. When you first log in, this section will be blank. To generate the palettes, first click conditions and then select dentistry from the palette dropdown box. This will generate all the palettes slash templates that can be used to document the visit. Now on to charting. The dental assistant completes the intake palette with the patient prior to you seeing them. When you go into the room, make sure to review the responses with the patient. You can open and review the patient's responses by clicking on the intake palette. When going through each section in the top left box, you have the option of clicking on any of the preformed phrases, or you can enter the response directly into the answer box. If you need to select multiple responses from the preformed phrase list, select multiple at the bottom and then select all the phrases that apply. If you need to make changes to the information that was previously entered, Click on the answer box and insert your response. If you attempt to make changes in the box located in the lower right hand corner, nothing will happen. You can, however, add to the note by typing outside of the note replacement boxes. Next, review x-rays. In addition to doing the intake, the dental assistant also takes x-rays prior to you seeing the patient. The x-ray palette allows you to enter what type of x-rays were taken and provide a read. Next, document your exam. Click on the exam palette and pick the appropriate option. Select periodic exam if it is a routine slash annual visit, limited oral evaluation dash problem focused if it's an emergency slash urgent exam, comprehensive exam if it is the patient's first visit. After you select the appropriate exam code, click the completed tab. Then click OK and the template box will open. Next, document your exam by filling out the note replacement sections and adding additional notes to the bottom left box. If doing an extraction, you can use the extract palette. Click the existing tab to document teeth that have already been extracted and plan tab to document teeth that you would like to remove in the future. The information that you enter here will show up in your dental schematic section. If something in the diagram is red, it is a planned service. For example, the future extraction of tooth 13. If something in the diagram is blue, it is something that was already done. For example, extraction of tooth six and tooth seven. To prescribe medications, you must enter the EHR. To do this, select EHR Dental from the top toolbar. This will take you to the Dental MU page. Double click a medication and the medication module will open. To prescribe medications, click Prescribe New. Enter the medication you would like to prescribe into the find box, double click on the appropriate dose and hit the select button. When prescribing medication, be sure to adjust the directions for taking the med by hitting edit SIG. Enter the medication quantity, number of refills, provider, which is your supervising provider for that day, and location. Once done, hit accept and the medication will go to the top of the medication list. You also need to send out the medication. Please see the supervising dentist to help you send out a prescription to the patient's pharmacy. Another useful tool is the documents icon located on the top toolbar. Clicking on this icon will allow you to select and print patient consents for any procedures that are done. Lastly, at the conclusion of the visit, complete the dismiss palette. 
Enter the time finished, patient response, treatment plan status, referral, and prescription information. If you want the front desk to be aware of something, for example, the patient needs to get a prescription filled or they need a referral to oral surgery, highlight the section and change the color to red. The information will stand out in the chart and let the front desk know what else needs to be done before the patient leaves. This concludes the dental EDR overview video. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video and best of luck at Venice Family Clinic.